My name is Wael and I am from Yemen. I am an MBA student. I worked as a civil engineer for a long time and uh, I thought that it's the time for me to change, to do something bigger, improve my career. And I thought MBA is uh, the best thing to do. Uh, I chose Canada because we respect the education there. And I chose UVEC because of the weather. I'm originally from Calgary and um, I looked at a few different universities but found that UVIC had a very reputable science program and after enrolling it a couple years in I found that I was really interested in biochemistry uh, which offered the co-op program and I was really excited to be able to do some hands-on work. It was great to be able to work alongside experts in leading edge cancer research. My name is Jason Niglent. Um, when I graduated from high school, uh, I decided to work full-time for a number of years and then eventually I decided to go back to university. And then I found out about UVic's mandatory co-op program and I was very drawn to that because of my previous work experience and I really valued having real hands-on experience. So I decided to transfer to UVic and then when I got here, I decided to take electrical engineering because of my biggest interest in robotics, cameras and space. is that I wanted to learn uh, to work in a new communication style. Uh, dealing with different cultures, de dealing with people who speak different languages, um, that was very important because I learned in my MBA program that um, it's different to do business in different places around the world. So that was very important and I worked hard to improve that skill uh, during my uh, co-op. Uh, the other thing was all the skills and competencies related to being a consultant. Um, being able to analyze, being able to um, divide the big complex problem to uh, the smaller components and look at them uh, once at a time. And the third one was uh, being able to just improve the, the procedures and the work environment by uh, looking at things that's not really uh, under your basic job description, stuff that you want to improve and it's, um, it will help the business. I learned a lot of technical aspects about how cameras work and how they function and some image processing, which is very related to space. The things I learned, the technical skills, the project development, are, are critical. And I found that the material I was learning on my jobs did augment my academic studies quite well. So, but they also, they complemented it and gave me more, more professional skills. Just like, well, living in another country where you don't speak the language, and trying to like grocery shop in a store you don't know. It's like everything's new and everything's different. So a lot of just, well, personal growth and I guess also professional growth. Well, I've learned a lot of valuable laboratory experiences like uh, troubleshooting and critical thinking and how to approach a problem and ask the right questions. But I've also learned a set of soft skills I think that are equally important. Uh, like professionalism um, and teamwork, cooperation, those kind of things. I feel like all of these together have made me much more confident when I work and given me an independence in, in approaching problems. First off, thank you very much. It's an invaluable experience and it's great that you guys hire co-op students like me. Uh, it, it helps so much in developing our personal skills and professional skills. I just like the feedback and listening to my employer talking about me at saying the good things and also the things that he wants me to improve it. And I think our generation really like to get feedback. When you hire a student, you just bring new blood. They are very motivated. They want to perform. They want to impress you. I think that co-op employers and what they do is really fantastic because without them, the co-op program wouldn't exist and I wouldn't have the successes I have today or been able to find what my full potential is as a contributing member of society.